Thank you very much. My name is Eric Abelos, and this is The Morning Boat. Just last time, last segment, we had the <coughs> band Chase the Wind on with us, and they were awesome. So go check them out tonight at the Corner Slice. They're going to play a show. Today, I'm going to talk to you, for this, for this last section, I want to bring up the Winter Carnival. There is so many activities to attend and, and events to attend during the Winter Carnival that I, I could not begin to list them all for you. I started writing down a couple, and I was just going to kind of read it off to you, but <laughs> I had to stop because I was like, well, I've only got three minutes to talk to you, and this was going to take all of like 25 to talk to you about it. So, so let's talk about it. The Winter Carnival, this has been going on for 107 years this year makes 107 so it, it originated because people were getting cabin fever just stuck in their cabins all the time and uh, all winter long so midwinter they said let's throw a carnival and this is the 107th time that we have agreed to doing doing this and it's crazy every year it gets bigger and bigger so this year it's from the 5th of February through the 9th so that is five days of partying and festival and carnival and craziness it kicks off on the fifth with opening ceremonies at 5 30 p.m and that is going to consist of speed and flight night ski jumping okay so first off you have to be crazy in order to do this ski jumping thing if you if you are in steamless rings look behind downtown look at howelson hill there they've got those nordic ski jumping areas you have to be crazy to launch yourself off of one of those jumps. And these guys for opening ceremonies are gonna be doing it for, let's see, what is it? Uh, two hours, 5.30 to 7.30 at night. Mind, mind blown. These guys, okay, go watch that. You have to, you have to participate in watching that. Uh, there's always tons and tons of people in town. Let's see, the 6th, we've got the Snow Sculpture Judging at 4 p.m. So, Snow Sculpture Judging, we actually um, put huge mounds of snow up and down downtown Steamboat Springs on either side of the road, and teams participate in carving different sculptures. And, and then on the 6th, people get to actually, there's judges that actually will grade them on how well they did and their their methods and all that what it looks like and it's a lot of fun people enjoy doing that there's there's prizes to be won too like if you're like a part of a company or just a part of like the high school students so the high school seniors and they actually get to get out of class to go carve these sculptures. This is how big of a deal Winter Carnival is, guys. And then there's going to be street events, too, on the 6th, on the, on the 7th, 8th, and 9th. So the 8th, let me talk to you about the 8th. Well, let's talk 7th first. 7th, there's also going to be more ski jumps, live music. This is Friday. Uh, there's going to be Tito's is going to be downtown, so you can go check them out and grab a drink while you enjoy all of the events that are happening. Just bizarre, bizarre, bizarre. So eighth, the coolest thing is happening too. So I actually coached the high school drum line at, at the high school, the local high school here. And they, they every year are the only band to do, uh, to march in a marching band style on skis. So this has also been happening for 107 years, but th we are the only ones to do this. It is so cool, and um, it, it's, it's quite monumental. All right, so then also on the 8th, we've got Tim and Ed, who are just also bonkers. They are trying to set the world record for the largest firework ever to be deployed. Now, this is world record. So... Japan, China, London, the, how big those displays are, have nothing to little steamboat Springs, Colorado. These two are trying to make a firework that launches two miles in the air and is going to be over a mile wide explosion. So you, you have to participate in that too. That is Saturday night, that's uh, February 8th. That there's the extravaganza that night too. So they got the light, the light man that skis down and shoots fireworks off of himself. It's 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 chaos. 
it is it is fun and it is chaos. Get down here, check it out. I, I'm not even going to get to the ninth because I, I have to start wrapping this up. I'm already at six minutes. So thank you so much for tuning in. You need to stick around after this at 9 p.m. We start Discover Steamboat, and we're going to talk to you more things to do in Steamboat Springs, Colorado. Thank you for coming back, and back to you in the studio. Mm -hmm.